What is up guys? We are back for another installment of the Ezio franchise, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Yeah, I've been waiting for a good while to get into this game. I've played this game on multiple occasions, so I guess it's the one I'm most familiar with. Oh, I get a ward. Look at that. I recognize me. Hold on. I ain't put my thing in here. There we go. Here we go. I don't think anyone ever expects to wake up one morning and find themselves caught in the middle of a war between two secret organizations. I know I didn't. But here I am. On one side are the Templars, better known these days as Abstergo Industries. They're in the business of control. Politics, economics, technology. They won't stop until every single one of us serves them. Literally. Fighting against them are the Assassins, a group dedicated to safeguarding humanity's free will. I was born into the Brotherhood. A couple of weeks ago, the Templars found me. They took me prisoner. Strapped me into a machine they built and put me to work. It's called an Animus. That's where I spent most of my time. Exploring the memories of my ancestors. Discovering entire lives locked deep inside my DNA. First, I revisited the life of Altair ibn La'ahad, an assassin from the Crusades. The Templars wanted the location of something known as a Piece of Eden, an ancient artifact capable of bending people to their will. Once the Templars had what they were looking for, they decided my usefulness had come to an end. But Lucy saved me. Lucy. When things were at their worst, she revealed herself to be an assassin and helped me escape. I was hoping that would be the end of my misadventures. But we were just getting started. Back into another Animus I went. Now, I'm reliving the memories of Ezio Auditore da Firenze, my ancestor from the Renaissance, searching for a path forward. Through the bleeding effect, I'm becoming an assassin in more than just name. It will come in handy as the Templars prepare to enslave us all. They found us. They've crashed our hideout and we're fleeing the scene looking for a place to hide. Yep. Only there isn't any and time is running short. My name is Desmond Miles, and this is my story. Ooh, I get chills just thinking about this. How did you fight? Mario Alvitore, let me hear. Oh, there we go. I'll get back to you. You gotta love the white screen. Understand. Please wait. I have so many questions. Let's see if it continued from my past save file. Or is it something entirely different? Uh, I guess not. 
21st century. Here we go. I'll read that over a little bit later. Oh, that reminds me. Let me put the subtitles on. Because, you know, they do speak Italian, and I'm sure you want to hear what they actually say. Probably should have done that in the, in the first game, but, you know, you know, we'll see. We'll correct it this time. <laughs> Of course, the Pope is gone. <laughs> oh. Cora? in the hands of the earth than in the hands of man. Uncle. What can I say? We sent a single man against an entire army. I was worried. Quick, climb up. We have to get out of here. Oh. I know this game all too well. Except that part. <laughs> there we go. There we go. You would not believe the things I have seen, Mario. Then be sure to stay alive that I might hear of them. I expect opposition. And I expect the Borgia to mourn the loss of many lives tonight. That's Mario for you. That's Uncle Mario. And we'll probably look at the new entries later. Che cosa fate qui? Assassini! God will see you pay for your crimes! You have desecrated the sanctity of this holy place! You condemn what you do not understand! We must go, Ezio, now! Man, get out of my way. Did Rodrigo manage to hurt you? Barely. My armor blunted his attack. Be ready to fight. Great. What are you doing? Saving you from the local thing. <laughs> Come on. Not bad for an old man. Agree. You still have some skill. Come on. Bona questa. Excellent. Good one. Impressive. You're dead. <laughs> oh, the fighting mechanics. You gotta love it. Of course you run into them. Not you. Get out of the way. <laughs> there we go. Alright, let's roll. Oh, 
Come on, old timer. Okay, so it doesn't keep your your safe. Um, it doesn't keep your save file. Come on. Come on. It doesn't keep your save file, so all that money I had in my in the second game, it doesn't transfer over. Okay. I wanted to be sure. It's a weird number just to have randomly, you know. Fifty-three thousand seven hundred twenty-four. I wonder how Ubisoft like thought about it, cause after a while you just make stupid money in Assassin's Creed too. So it's like, what do you do with all that money? They just like, you know what? You don't need all that money. You got more money than you don't even know what to do with. So, they cut it down to this. I thought I'd get at least a hundred thousand. This decision is yours alone to make. Only do so quickly. Give it to me. You can do with it as you will later. Bene. Jump! Oh, and this is on PS4, guys. So, just in case you're wondering, because the graphics look about the very sun. good. She told of a disaster that occurred long ago, and another that is coming. Sometime far in the future, Vero. Then we need not worry about it. See, si. perhaps our work is finished. Would that be so bad? Mm, no. No, it wouldn't be that bad. Okay. <laughs> we upgraded the arsenal while you were away. Ah, oh, and it is now customary for you to fire cannonballs at visitors. My apologies. We only installed them a few days ago. My men are still being trained in their use. I see. <laughs> but you see how clean it is? Like... The graphics look very good. Um, they do it. They do the game justice. You know, the funny thing is, people think Assassin's Creed 2 is one of the best in the series. All right. If it had the fighting mechanics of Brotherhood, maybe. Maybe. Buongiorno. Salve, it's good to be home. Two of them. This place just keeps getting better. So, Thanks. that's just my take on it. Brother! Claudia. It is good to be home. How is mother? She's fine. I, I heard you were returning, but I'm glad to see it with my own eyes. The Contessa of Forli is here to welcome you. I had no idea you were so famous. Katarina? Here? Is it finished then? Is the Spaniard truly dead? Gather the others in Mario's study tonight. I'll explain everything there. Steal yourself, Ezio. They will have many questions. Claudia, tell the Contessa I look forward to seeing her this evening. Claudia, I'm sorry. Oh, Claudia looks like like they touched up on her a little bit, you know. 
like a lot more than Assassin's Creed 2, so she looks better, but I think Ezio looks had the like the best outcome. These boxes hit as far as graphics. To be. So many flowers. Your husband must be very lucky. I am the lucky one. I have you here to aid me. Let me see what I can do. Back there, I may have given you the wrong impression. Oh? I have no husband. The flowers are for a party. Am I invited? To Claudia Auditori's birthday party in the villa. If you are willing to help me again, I need someone with class to accompany me. What makes you think I have class? I could tell the moment I saw you. No one in this town walks with such bearing. I'm certain Ezio Auditori himself would be impressed. Oh? What do you know of Ezio? Claudia thinks the world of him, but he rarely visits her. From what I gather, he's distant. She is right. I have been. Oh no. <laughs> you? The party was intended to be a surprise. <laughs> Promise you will not tell Claudia. What will you do to keep me quiet? I am sure I can think of several things. I'll be waiting to hear them when we get there. <sighs> Let's see you at its finest. Now about earning my silence. I have something in mind. There is one condition. Anything. You must wait until tomorrow. If it pleases you, I will not stand in your way. It will be worth the wait, Ezio. Trust me. The way she just Morocco walked away. Ugh. <laughs> Clearly, I'm not the only one who's seen that, right? <laughs> Alright, let's get the rest of these missions done. We just push it all in one episode. Might be stopping at 30, maybe 35, give or take. But I have a deep love for this game. Alright, where are you? Oh. He's down. Oh, he's down there. You know what? I'll just go to this guy. So, these are the new cannons? Yes, Signor Ezio. May I try one? Yes, but... Go on, tell him. We cannot seem to make them work properly, and the fool who mounted them is nowhere to be found. Then it is up to me to find him. We do not want to waste your time. It is not any trouble. I have all the time in the world now. Let's go find that engine there. Okay, camera. This controller is not, uh, well, it, it's good enough to be recording with, but, you know. Salve, Messere. We need you to fix the cannons on the battlements. Leave me be. I do not begin repairs before noon. Do you know what time it is? I make cannons, not clocks. If you are busy, someone else will fix them. Uno momento. No one else will touch my cannons. Soldiers have no respect for artillery. They expect a gun to work like magic. You need to feel her out. Give her a little encouragement. We are only <laughs> equipped with simple cannons now. But I got hold of a design from France. Yeah? A hand cannon. Something called a wrought iron murderer. Imagine firing a cannon from your hands. <laughs> that is the future. It is. Yeah, especially around this time. It's like 15, yeah, 1500. So, yeah, cannons and hand cannons and really just pistols were being remained. What have you done? Around this time. So. We use them. They were not ready for firing. Oh, you could have gotten us all killed. You see the spit. <laughs> <laughs> Tur 
His breath is more fatal than our cannons. Only when you two fools are shooting them. There, try it. Oh, I guess I'm trying it. Aim at something to test the alignment. I think right. Yep, got him. Tomorrow, do not worry. We will be practicing at dawn. Too bad it will not do you any good. Very funny. Now fix the second cannon. <laughs> the funny part to me is you only have two cannons in this whole castle. You only have two cannons. That's pretty sad. Buongiorno. Ezio, Mario is going to murder me. I have lost his favorite horse. Do not despair. I will bring it back. God bless you, Ezio. Ah, come here. Ah, got you. Come on. Nope, no. Nope. You want to get back here. Not gonna play hussy fit games with me. Not today. Uh, here. Grazie, Ezio. I can no longer keep up with the horses. Promise me you will enjoy your good health. Do not spend as much time in battle as your Uncle Mario. My battles have already been won. That is good news. Arrivederci, Ezio. Oh, most of them. <laughs> to be honest, I don't think he should have spared him, though. Why would you spare the Spaniards? <laughs> oh, I don't know. If it was me, it would just... <laughs> he would be dead already. No doubt about it. Well, let's see what we got here. Buongiorno, Ezio. Caterina, to what do I owe the pleasure of your presence here? I desire an allegiance. The papal armies have resumed their march on Forli. Your mercenaries would be a great asset to my cause. It is likely that I can give you what you seek. But we will talk later. Mother! Machiavelli. It is done. Though not, I think, as any of us expected. I entered the Vaticano and faced Rodrigo. No! He used the power of the papal staff against me, but I defeated him. Combining the staff and the apple, I gained access to the vault. There, a moving painting of the goddess Minerva spoke. She told of a terrible tragedy to befall mankind in the future. Gave hope of lost temples that will provide aid to humanity. And then she called out to a phantom, Desmond, as if he were there, standing beside me. After her warning, she vanished. Amazing. I cannot imagine such wonders. The vault did not house the terrible weapon we feared. This is good news. Yeah. What of this goddess, this Minerva? Did she appear human? Yes, but her words proved otherwise. All of her kind died many years ago. I wish I could show you the magic she performed. Who is Desmond, and where are these temples Minerva spoke of? 
I do not know. Perhaps we must search for them. Tell me how it ended with Borgia. Did Rodrigo beg forgiveness? Make excuses? Promise power in return? No. None of those things. Interesting. I'm surprised he remained so composed. I let him leave. The Spaniard lives? Once our enemies are dead, we can speak of vaults and gods and ancient places. You should have killed him. We're sure to suffer for it. I am not here to debate the past. Together, we should discuss the future. No. I am leaving immediately for Roma. Ezio, I do not know why you spared him. I but I don't trust know why your judgment. <laughs> Machiavelli will come around. I just don't think it was a good idea. <laughs> I just, I don't think it was. Why spare him? I don't know. Yep, got it. And all the paintings I collected. <laughs> Everything. Oh no, maybe I spoiled it. If, if you guys don't know, you should go watch the Assassin's Creed 2 play it through. Um, I'll probably leave a playlist under this video of it. So, you guys check it out. Let's continue. I don't know why Ezio did not marry her. Seriously. You don't need to ask. <laughs> One should always have the freedom to choose. Shh. What's that? <sighs> Probably just training exercises. So, um, on a scale of 1 to 10, how is that training or exercise going? I have to find Mario and rally the troops. My men are in the courtyard. I aim to lead them around back and flank our attackers. Stay out of sight. not see this. They must have passed to the east during the night. We need to hold them off until the townspeople have escaped. I will take care of it. Use the cannons above the rampart. I intend to lead a frontal assault. 
Do you have it? I am keeping it safe. The Borgia must not be allowed to breach the walls until everyone is safely away. Insieme per la vittoria. Insieme. Uncle, be careful. I will. Why didn't why didn't he give Ezio back the apple? That's the question. Well, looks like we just lost a lot of stuff. blow up this crowd right here. <laughs> Wait, the walls. Go! I will carry on here. That's how you get down. Come on.
He said, stay out of sight. Katarina, what are you doing? I know your man, Ezio. Oh, my gosh. The Pope told me about you and your little group of assassins. Andres! Give me the gun, his friend passion for us. We've had too much bloodshed. I think a cleansing is in order. So consider this an invitation from my family to yours. Uncle. 